So we're back on track with the inventions uh, series. It's been a while, a bit longer than I expected uh, because there were some other projects uh, which needed to be finished. Uh, first was this one, second album by Myra Orchestra uh, called Oracle, uh, which I produced and played uh, drums on. And this album was released at the end of March. And after that, uh, we released this album with my other band called Sky Architect. And this is our fourth album called Nomad, uh, which was released on the same day as this CD, which is part one of the Inventions uh, series. Uh, so that's now available on CD. Check it out. So that's cool. And we're planning to do at least a couple of more seasons. Uh, so that's something to look forward to. And the first song of the new season uh, is going to be called Pocket universe and there's also a video online of this song as a kind of teaser for the series and you can get a free download of this song if you subscribe to my patreon channel which you can find at uh, patreon.com slash inventions and this song is about bicycles uh, or rather wheels as a kind of metaphor for moving forward uh, but at the same time being caught in a kind of fixed cycles or repetitions so for the drums of this song, I got an idea from Balinese uh, gamelan music where they use so-called interlocking rhythms. And one thing they do with it is create two rhythms which play at the same time. And the first half of let's say rhythm one is the same as the second half of rhythm two and the other way around. So the second half of rhythm one is also the same as the first half of rhythm two. So you get this kind of interlocking rhythms and I really like the simplicity and also the symmetry of this idea. So I thought I'd use it with kick drum and snare drum. Sounds like this. Round and round and round they go. They take me everywhere I want. From here on a rocket. So in music there's a thing called the tonic which is basically the tonal center of a piece of music. For instance if I were to play a song in the key of C. The C is the first note in the scale and also the tonic and the tonic chord is built upon this note. In this case C major and a lot of times you will hear that songs uh, begin and end on the tonic chord. Because it kind of feels like home. Uh, there's no tension there, no restlessness. Uh, it also doesn't feel like it needs to go somewhere else. Uh, but for instance if I were to end like this. It doesn't feel finished. You kind of expect it to go back to C. And that's the thing about the tonic, it's really the center of your piece of music. And every tonic has its own dominant, uh, which is on the fifth note of the scale. One, two, three, four, five. And the chord built on this note, the dominant chord, kind of has the function to create tension in order to resolve back to the tonic. And this effect is, uh, is sometimes being uh, enhanced by uh, adding a seventh, so instead of a G, make a G7. And now you really want to go back to tonic. So in this song I start on the tonic, I think it was B. But then I kind of transform it, I add a seven. And it doesn't really feel like a tonic anymore. Now it actually feels a bit like a dominant chord. Which needs to resolve to a new tonic, in this case E. But then I transform that one at a 7. Now you want this one to resolve. 
to a new tonic, in this case A. Add a 7. Resolve. Add a 7. And a new tonic. So in this way you can create this whole cycle uh, of tension. Release. Tension. Release. Tension. Release. Tension. And so it goes on. And in this way, by following this kind of simple formula, I can generate all the major chords uh, on the piano. And lately I've been a bit obsessed by these simple formulas, which can generate whole sequences uh, of chords. And in this case, it also fits the theme and the lyrics of the song uh, quite well, because the song is about endless cycles and repetitions. And the chords of this song follow the circle of fifths uh, two times, and then the song is finished. So much for the first episode of this new season of uh, Inventions. Thanks for watching. Please go to patreon.com slash inventions and subscribe if you would like to receive a new song every two weeks uh, along with other extra stuff in return for your support. And until next video, cheers.